What was that name again? Oh, this is frustrating me to no end. I simply can't recall. Oh, I have it. Xanado. That's it. It was not long ago that we were there. And still, I somehow managed to forget. Well, that place brought back some fragments of my memory. I cannot help but wonder why. I feel we must return to find some answers there. Yes, you are right. For as the saying goes, there is no time like the present. Hmm, our professor is sneaking off alone. Where to, I wonder? I don't recall hearing of any such plans for our class. Perhaps we should follow. Intrigued, are we? Yes, let's do just that. We will consider it extra training. Yes, it is all coming back to me. This structure... Oh, but it's as though my memories are clouded. The most important pieces are obscured. I once called this home. I have no doubt. I seem to recall something on the other side of that wall. I cannot see it, but I can still feel it. It is not my imagination. I know this to be true. We are already deep within this valley. <laughs> that awful sound yes and that was not a normal beast but a huge and terrifying one look there at the entrance of the valley a giant shadow must have riled them up. We have no choice but to fight our way out. Give it your all! It's good we've caught up with the Professor, but this situation is hard to put into words, actually. Wolves to the front, hawks to the rear, and what appears to be a demonic beast at the canyon's mouths. A wild beast at that, or perhaps it's more fitting to call it a stray. If we can't prevail over that demonic beast, we won't make it out of the Red Canyon alive. The first thing we need to do is reunite with our professor. The wolves are closing in. More hawks. This is bad. We'll be caught from both sides. <laughs> the hawks are still coming. Perhaps we should see to those before we deal with the beast.
my body and mind. This thing, it has no will or mind to call its own. You must now strike it down. That is the best you can hope to offer this poor lost soul. is done? My, my, things did not go as planned. Let us return before any more hawks or wolves join us. But what was that demonic beast doing within the Red Canyon? I'm glad that you are safe, Professor. It was rather reckless of you to venture out alone like that. I suppose we came out here without permission, too. If we all wish to avoid punishment, perhaps we can all agree that we came out here for an extracurricular activity. Let's leave it at that. Still, I would like to know what brought you to this valley in the first place. Oh dear! I put us in a bit of danger there! <laughs> We are most fortunate that those delinquents followed us. You very nearly met your end. <laughs> what a marvelous professor you must be for all your students to be so concerned. Hmm, you seem more confident in your ability to teach. But that makes sense, as you have me to help you out. <sighs> How disappointing to have dived so deeply into danger, and yet to have nothing to show. Huh? What is this strange feeling? My memories. Do you feel them stirring? How curious. You seem to have grown stronger. And all thanks to our journey to Xanado. It really was worth all that effort. Huh? You found this? I dare say you may find a use for that. You should decide how best to use that thing. But wow! We got a lot out of this trip. It was a bother for a spell, but in the end, I feel we should think fondly of our little trip. We actually had a delightful time, wouldn't you say? <laughs> Bye.